What's up guys, John here from Titan and I'm back with another health and fitness tip for you guys. That's right, so I'm trying to bring you guys some awesome fitness and health tricks that will help you guys obtain your goal, whatever it may be. There's a lot of goals out there, so I'll have more tips for you guys in the future, so stay tuned to that. But in the meantime, let's talk about today, right now, for you guys. So let's talk about losing weight, right? And there's a lot of different things to lose weight, but we need to talk about some core things to do to lose weight. Now, I'm sure you've heard these things over and over and over again, but I'm still gonna say them to you because you've gotta really ingrain them into your mind so you get a hold of it, wrap your hands around it, and say, I'm going to do this and I have the necessary tools to achieve what I'm trying to do here. So let's talk about it. So, when we wanna do weight loss, we gotta think about a couple different aspects here. Obviously, we gotta think about nutrition. It's a part of it, okay? What you're eating, you are what you eat. Remember that, okay? So look at all the labels, pick some good food sources, um, you know, people are going to hit me like, what should I eat? We'll talk about the whole different segment, but today let's talk about some of the main things. So obviously nutrition plan, find something that works for you, right? If you don't know, you can sort out a professional and they're going to help you out. Two, exercise program. It's essential, right? And when we talk about exercise programs, when people talk about losing weight, they only think about like getting on a treadmill or getting on an elliptical. I have to do a whole bunch of cardiovascular and I got to run like a little mouse on a wheel. It's not true. That's not true at all. You can make this fun. You can make this more appeasing to you and you can get a lot more out of just achieving weight loss, right? Let's talk about that. So when we talk about weight loss and different exercises for it, obviously cardiovascular is going to be in there. You need to have cardiovascular activity. You need to raise the, your heart rate. You need to burn calories. That's going to be you, yes, doing some cardiovascular activity. And this can be a lot of different things. It just doesn't have to be running on a treadmill. You can do a lot of different things. You can Google this and look up a ton of different cardiovascular exercises because it would take me too long to even mention on this video all the different things that you could possibly do. So look into that. Along with that is weightlifting. You have to weight train on some sort of level. So if you've had a bad car accident and your right leg is not as good as your left leg or something is going on there, you can still exercise. You just gotta find some different techniques that are gonna work best for you, right? But let's say you're okay. Everything's fine there. You need to really think about weight training. And this is the reason why I say this. When we talk about weight loss, we want to lose weight, right? Well, we know this, the more muscle you have in your body, the more fat you're gonna burn every single day and every single minute in that day. So we need to have some sort of muscle in there. When you do cardiovascular activity, when you look at a runner, most runners out there, they're real lean. There's not a whole bunch of muscle mass on them. And you don't have to be a bodybuilder. I'm not talking about that but you definitely want to look at building some muscle because this muscle will burn fat right along with the cardiovascular activity that you're doing and burning more fat. Your metabolism will be through the roof and you'll be happy and you'll be getting results day in and day out, I promise. After that, sleep. Sleep is essential, okay? Getting in good sleep patterns and routines is gonna be essential for not just weight loss, but for your overall health, that's right, your general health, the way that you feel every single day of your life ultimately comes from a little bit of sleep. We need sleep. Our bodies need to recharge. If you have an electric car, you're possibly thinking about an electric car, they need to charge too, right? Or it's not gonna run. That's exactly what's happening to you. And when we get sleep deprivation or we're not getting enough rest, our body is not working at optimal levels and all the different functions in it are not gonna work that good either. So think about sleep too as well. After that, we need some recovery. Think about recovery, guys, because you know, we want to go, go, go. I want to train seven days a week, two hours a day, two a days. That's great, right? But your body does need a little bit of downtime to recover. And you need to do the right things for recovery. Day in and day out. That's getting enough water, getting enough nutrients, whatever it may be. Your macros, carbohydrates, your proteins, your fats. And you need to make sure these are all correct. If you don't know those, trust me, you can get really amateur about it and go seasonal and get really, really uh, in-depth about it later on but start somewhere where you can get a grasp on things and it's very easy for you to assume like, all right, I can take this or I can do this and this is what I need to eat, right? So these things, especially recovery, sleep is a part of recovery, but giving yourself enough downtime so your muscles rebuild and rejuvenate themselves and rebuild stronger than when you previously had them before. That's what it's all about. So guys, these are the pillars, tips and tricks for you guys. I know you probably hear them a lot. You're like, man, I hear this all the time. But really, what can I dial in? That's where some of the Titan Medical Center therapies can help you guys out. And listen, if you're doing everything right, you're saying, John, I've hit every single thing that you said, and I haven't lost weight, I'm gaining weight. This is just not going like it should be. Well, we might need to reassess some of the things in a different program, or you might need to look at maybe some blood work. 
and look at where your hormones are at, where these different levels are at in the body. Make sure they're optimal so your body can run and perform like it's supposed to. So guys, if you need help in this, we're here for you. But I want to give you some different things that you guys can do at home, right? Where you can look at these different things and say, am I doing every single pillar that I need to? The four pillars of getting a healthy lifestyle and getting in those habits. And habits are the most important thing. And that's the next video I'm going to talk about for you guys. So you guys like this tip and trick? I hope you guys did. Make sure you guys are tuning in for the next one. And guys, as always, check out the med website, TitanMedicalCenter.com. If you want to check out some different videos that I've done, go over to YouTube. Just type in Titan Medical Center. You'll see all the great, good content, videos, explain some of the therapies and all the other good stuff that come along with it. And if you want help with the therapies itself, you want to become a patient, you want some help in your journey of health, weight loss, or fitness, call or text us today, 727-389-3220. And guys, stay tuned for the next health tip and trick from me, John, CEO of Titan Medical Center. See you guys.